Hello and welcome to the Titus Time Out podcast. I'm Jenny Abney Sivy, and today I'm going to discuss the difference between the high throw and the jet throw flow bar. So flow bar is a really popular Titus architectural diffuser. It can be tape and mudded into a ceiling so it looks like just a slot where the air comes out, and it can even be curved. So you often see it in lobbies, atriums, and some other high-end places. It's a good combination of performance and aesthetics. But we're often asked, what's the difference between the high throw version and the jet throw version? So the difference is in the pattern controller. If you recall from one of the early podcasts, the pattern controller is what controls where the airflow is directed in a linear diffuser. The high throw pattern controller kind of looks like this. So those would be the edges of the diffuser. And then it has a pattern controller that kind of looks like a dumbbell on the inside. And then you slide it back and forth like this to adjust how you want the airflow pattern. So in this case, if you've got it pushed all the way to the left side, the air will come out and go around this way. And let's draw one with it pushed all the way to the other side. Now the air here is going to come and go this way along the ceiling. And then if you have it set in the middle, the air is going to go around both sides and go straight down. Now let's look at the jet throw pattern controller. So again, you've got the frame of the diffuser. And then the jet throw pattern controllers are kind of hinged up here at the top. And you adjust them by moving them back and forth like this. So in this case, the airflow would just come straight down and go through the diffuser. Now let's draw another one, and now let's angle them towards the right. Sorry, that probably shouldn't curve, they're both straight. But it'll direct the air towards the right. And now another one towards the left, and it'll direct the air towards the left. So they would be used for different applications. The high throw pattern controller is good if you want to move the air along the ceiling. If you look at the picture, you can see how the air is kind of going to come out of the diffuser and go along the ceiling where that the diffuser is mounted in. The jet throw is good if you have a high ceiling and you need extended throw, so you really want to get the air, say, from an atrium down into the occupied space. So that's the difference between the flow bar high throw and jet throw pattern controllers. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel, and thanks for taking a time out with us.